edifying others calls all his viewers, bastards, and swine, because they refuse to buy his lies, even he offers a 50% discount. There's no doubt about it that you're getting your quail. The quail of Alex Jones and the quail of Donald Trump and the quail of the fake left-right paradigm of the Democrats. And therefore, you deserve quail, like the children of Israel, and you deserve to be struck down. Again, edifying others fails to understand the lesson taught in Numbers 11. So he blasphemes the quail, sent to Israel from God, and likens God's quails to the unclean food from Alex Jones and Trump. Just as he fails to understand Job 39, and blasphemes the Son of God, making the Son of God, both the killer, and its praise, this exposes edifying others' confused mind, like that of a swine, is void of the Holy Spirit, and full of, lies. Yahweh struck the sons of Israel, with the plague, not because they asked for unclean meat, but because of their fleshy craving and self-reliance. Though Yahweh had promised them meat, for a whole month, they spent two full days, storing up, and curing the quail, for themselves. There is no prophet in the land to tell you what's going on, and I'm certainly not going to cast my pearls before you swine that want to eat quail. Christians do not need false prophets, like edifying others. Christians are given the anointing, the Holy Spirit who teaches us everything. And when your quail hits you, I will be laughing at how stupid you people are. I will be laughing at how stupid you people are. Edifying others is the most stupid swine among all false prophets, false apostles, and false teachers filled with fake pearls and hatred.